real-world forensic investigation is getting closer to the one-hour crime-solving television world with a new invention called Antibody Profiling Identification, or ABPID. ABPID identifies individuals based on immune system antibodies, which by the age two are as unique as DNA or fingerprints. These antibodies are different even between identical twins. Researchers at the Idaho National Laboratory developed a method to turn individual antibody profiles into a unique pattern that can be used to identify an individual from very small samples of blood, sweat, tears, and other bodily fluids. This technology received a 2008 Federal Laboratory Consortium Award for excellence in technology transfer. Working closely with Partner Identity Sciences, they have developed ABPID into a commercially available testing system with pattern identification software that provides sample analysis results and comparisons in two to five hours, compared with days or weeks for DNA. ABPID provides a low-cost, easy-to-use, accurate, and rapid method for matching individuals with forensic evidence. ABPID is a valuable forensic pre-screening tool because at a typical crime scene, there will be hundreds of pieces of evidence, and with the current DNA technologies, it's prohibitively expensive to analyze all of those pieces of DNA. With ABPID, investigators can quickly get results at a low cost, and then only pick the key pieces of evidence to send on for DNA testing. ABPID uses a proprietary immunoblotting method to detect and visualize individual autoantibody patterns. Using the ABPID test, a microsample of only one fiftieth of a drop of blood placed on a specially prepared paper strip impregnated with 10,000 proteins will reveal a unique visual profile of 20 to 30 dark bands. This animation shows how specific autoantibodies bind to companion proteins on each ABPID test strip. Once developed, a unique pattern emerges linking the sample to the individual it came from. Because ABPID does not require cellular material, it is a very versatile forensic tool that works with fluids such as tears and perspiration. ABPID also incorporates an R&D 100 award-winning digital image comparison technology, Idaho National Laboratory's Change Detection System. The Image ID system can scan test strips, archives patterns into a database similar to fingerprint or DNA databases, and compares samples to any or all samples in the system. ABPID was beta tested at a number of forensic labs across the country. They tested those ABPID under conditions typical of a crime scene. They looked at contaminants like dirt, chemicals, animal blood, denim, things like that, even under conditions where the current DNA testing suffers some problems. And they found that ABPID performed flawlessly under those conditions. They found the added benefit that there were no false positives from any of the ABPID tests. Some of the results we got back from the forensic scientists, they indicated that ABPID was very simple to use, it required very little training on their part, didn't require any specialized equipment, and they felt that ABPID was an excellent complement to their current DNA testing. Beyond gaining acceptance at beta sites, the Idaho National Laboratory and Identity Sciences researchers have presented or been invited to share ABPID technology at numerous forensic conferences. Beyond its valuable forensic application, ABPID can be used as a quick method for identifying individuals in a hospital setting, tracking test results or samples, organ matching and confirmation, and has the potential for use in identifying specific infections. ABPID also could be used in security to confirm identities, as well as in agriculture for tracking animal products from the farm to the store shelf. ABPID is a major breakthrough in forensic evidence identification. It is a field deployable technology that offers accurate, near real time results for investigators. ABPID may prove to be the most powerful forensic tool since DNA.